So here what I've got is just some moving legs and I'm going to show you how you can put this guy on top of the legs, make the top body rotate to face the mouse whilst his legs still face where he's walking and also shoot bullets towards the mouse from his gun. So I've got three objects, player top, player legs and the bullets. In player top I've got the fire bullet behaviour and I've moved the origin point to the centre because this is where he's going to rotate around and be put on the legs and I've also made a muzzle point for his gun. On the player legs object, I've got the top down movement, and if I go into the points, I've also moved the origin point to the center, and the bullet is just an object. So now in the events, I'm going to make a new event. I'm not going to have a condition, because when there's no condition, it happens all the time. I'm going to add an action, I'm going to go into position, position of an object, player top, I'm going to set to player legs dot x, and then player legs dot y. So now if I play it, you'll see that our torso is on the legs. And now to make it rotate towards the mouse, add an action, type in angle, rotate toward position, player top. The X position is just going to be mouse X and the Y position, mouse Y. And so now to make the bullet shoot out of the gun, we can make a new event, add a condition, mouse and touch, mouse button pressed or touch held, left. And in the action, fire bullets, fire bullet, fire a bullet. And we want the player top, which is the one that we added the fire bullet behavior to, the X position is going to be player top dot x then in the brackets in quotation marks i'm going to put in muzzle which is the point that i made on the gun and same thing here player top but dot y and then once again the muzzle for the bullet objects i'm going to put bullet and the angle of the bullet since we can't do mouse x and mouse y we can just do player top dot direction since the player top is already looking at the mouse we can just take its direction and speed of the bullet let's say 1000 now if we play it, you can see I can move around and my gun shoots. Just a quick tip here, if you're doing a pistol and you want it to only fire once and you don't want to hold it down and it fires automatically, you can add a condition and just do a trigger once while true. And now you've got to press every time you want it to shoot. Hope this helped you. Have fun. Mm -hmm.